Hello everybody, this is Taika, and in this video I'm going to be showing you the installation and configuration process of the scheduled announcer plugin. So, getting right into it, we're going to download the plugin from Bucket Dev, keep it, move it to our desktop, go to Server, open up our plugins directory, drag and drop it in, and then run the server. And when it's done running, we can then stop it and go into our plugins and go to the scheduled announcer. And we'll see a configuration file right here. This is actually quite easy to set up and it does have some other features. So, enabled, true or false, self explanatory, that's if you want it enabled or not. Random will display the messages in a random order. If you have this set to false, it'll go in order as it's listed. The prefix is how you have the beginning setup, so you can have this if you want it. So for example, if you wanted announcement in the beginning of every message, you can have that, or you could change it to something like info, or if you want to get a little more creative, you could do like have gray brackets, have the info to be gold, and then another gray bracket and then these would be gray and that would be gold. So interval is when the messages are displayed so that's in seconds so if I wanted one to display every minute I will just put 60 and then the next message would display. Now these are the actual messages so you could change these however you want. You want to keep them inside these things right here. So let's just say if I wanted to give a tip so I'd be like two use um, actually a tip would be to get money type forward slash jobs and then every once in a while that would display in the server when it came up so that's a example of a tip now there are, all, are other features for example um, you can give it support for commands so like it says in here on the on the thread if I put this in oops if I put this in it said now it will be day and then if you do forward slash n time day I mean and sign n time day then it will do the time day command and it will turn the time to day I think that's only for the default map though if you're doing the time command now it does support other commands so there's that now that's about it this is a rather simple and self-explanatory plugin when it comes to the configuration and installation I'm making this video upon request of one of my subscribers so I hope this helped you out in some sort of way if you still have questions feel free to ask me if you need to download this plugin there will be a link in the description and that's about it hope you have a good day please comment rate and subscribe